Have you ever wondered what actually causes carbon buildup inside your engine? Most people think it's just poor fuel or old oil. But the real story goes much deeper. Today we're breaking down why carbon builds up, how it slowly chokes performance, and what you can do to stop it before it costs you thousands in repairs. Every time you start your engine, combustion leaves behind microscopic carbon deposits. Over time, those tiny bits of soot cling to the intake valves, EGR valve, turbo vanes, and even inside the intake manifold. And here's the problem. Modern diesel and petrol engines are designed to recycle gases back into the intake, which accelerates that buildup even more. That's where the EGR, or exhaust gas recirculation system, comes in. Its job is to reduce emissions by redirecting a portion of exhaust gas back into the intake to be reburned. In theory, it helps lower nitrogen oxide levels and keeps the environment cleaner. But in reality, that same system feeds dirty, sooty exhaust back into your engine's airways, mixing with oil vapor and sticking to surfaces like tar. The result? A clogged intake, sluggish throttle response, higher fuel consumption and rough idle. If you've ever removed an EGR valve or looked inside an intake manifold and seen thick black sludge, that's the carbon we're talking about. The best fix isn't just cleaning, it's prevention. That's where an EGR delete cable comes in. It's a plug and play solution that electronically disables the valve for off-road or performance use, stopping those dirty gases from circulating. The result, cleaner air, smoother throttle, more power, and far less carbon over time. If you want to stop carbon buildup at the source, check the link in the description for our EGR delete cables. Hit like, subscribe, and drop your model in the comments. I'll let you know if there's a cable that fits.